I have a waterproof watch here and this back has to come off uh, so that I can get to the battery and I can't uh, pop the back of this watch off uh, you have to use a uh, tool or screw this off there are little grooves or indentations in the back of the of the watch here um, and I'm going to use a wrench it's actually called a case opener and it's for removing the back of these uh, watches So it is a wrench, um, and uh, it has three places to uh, to put the pins um, or the clamps that match up with these grooves on the back of the watch. And I found the ones that uh, work best for me here, and I've already put them in place. And they just snap in place, and once they're in place, they're uh, pretty secure. They're not going to fall out. Um, so you have to adjust these these three with at least three of these grooves on the back of the watch here. Um, you can adjust the lower pin here by twisting the handle and then there's a little knob screw here that will uh, adjust the top two pins. So I'm going to go ahead and match up the pins with the back of my watch I'll get two in first and then I'll work on the the bottom pin And once I uh, once I get them matched up, uh, pins and to the grooves there, then I just kind of snugly, securely tighten the the wrench here, the handle, and I will be I popped out there for a second here. Let me get that back in. Okay, there we go. So what I'll be doing here is just holding the watch firmly on the crystal of the watch and just uh, turning it, uh, unscrewing the back panel or back uh, of the watch. Uh, I'll be unscrewing it counterclockwise. Okay. So that worked. I think I can do it with my, my fingers now. Now I'm going to use a little instrument here to uh, just pop this off and you can see the battery there. Um, usually the batteries have a, a little clasp uh, plastic or can be thin metal that will uh, hold the battery in place. Uh, you either can lift it up or uh, push it to the side. Uh, this one doesn't have that and I don't know if it's broken off or if it's just held in place by the, the back of the of the watch but the, the battery is loose here uh, so I'm going to pop this out and uh, I want to make sure that the uh, the metal connector here is is not corroded and that looks pretty good and uh, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to find a new battery 
and to find the right battery just look on the back of your battery and you'll see the the size uh, the uh, size battery this particular battery is AGI or AG1 I guess so let me go to the batteries that I have here and I have uh, quite a few of the AG1 so I'm going to take one of those out okay now I have the new battery and I'm just looking at it and making sure that doesn't have any oxidation here. I want to get good connection um, with my, my watch there. Um, and that is the minus side, the smaller side, and that goes in first. You basically just put it in reverse of how you took the battery out. And that is not secure at all. It doesn't have one of those little clasps to go over it. So I'm just thinking that the uh, back of the of the watch will hold it in place. So I'm going to put it back on now. Before I tighten it with my wrench, let's take a look at it, and it's second hand's working, so that looks uh, good. And now I can take my wrench and match it, match the pins up or the clasp up. What do you call these? The match up the clamps, pins or pins or clamps here. I match those up with the little indentations in the back of my watch. Okay, it's in place again, and now I'm just going to turn it uh, clockwise. And that's good. So that was easy enough. Um, this uh, case opener has been a really good investment for me. It cost about $10, and I got this from a, a jewelry supply company. Um, ordered it through the mail or online. Um, I found that you can find a lot of these watches, good watches, you know, with the state sales or garage sales, and um, all you need is battery. It seems like people have just given up on them and, uh, you know, sell them for two, three, four dollars. And, uh, you know, if you have one of these, you know, you can easily take it off in a matter of minutes, seconds actually, and uh, change out your battery. So, uh, anyway, I hope this uh, would be helpful for someone out there. Until next time, have a great day.